What's good, Humble Squad? It's your boy, Humble Ziggy. We back here with another reaction for y'all, and you already know. We back with Otaku Underworld with the guy Sleepy Ash. And hey, this is finally a shock, you can say. But we're here with Sleepy Ash. Bad taste is, bad taste is good. Kind of cool. Hey, it is what it is. But featuring Dave D and Free Soul. Now look. Shout out to my guys. Dave, shout out to Dave D and Free Soul. Because y'all already know. We always. Like I say. We rock with Otaku in the world here. What I do. I'm sorry. I, hey. If y'all do too. Then. That's why, I knew, that's why me and y'all. The Humble Squad. We like this. But hey. Shout out to Otaku on the world man. And hey. Sleepy Ash. Look, I ain't trying to hate or anything, but I was going to say, like, man, don't get me wrong, right? You be fire on your own, too, right? Do not get it twisted. But I'm just saying, nigga, you got to remember, if you repping for Otaku Underworld, you got to make sure you put your niggas on your shit, too. That's all I'm saying. And especially when you got two of the fire spitters there and such. Come on, now. Dave D., Especially Dave D. Shit, that nigga. And Free Soul too. Man, you already know how we are. So you know what? We just gonna go straight right into it, man. On the road to 2K. So make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, man. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Now we going back to 2021's Sleepy Ash. Nah. Uh, well, then again, look, Sleepy Ash. If you see this, my guy, when I say when we going back to 2021, I mean like we going back to your last, your your former name and such. But regardless, like I said, no matter what the name changes is, whether it was known as Slick, formerly known as Slick, or Sleepy Ash, hey. Music is fire regardless. But I'm just saying, them type, this sounds right here, the way how it sounds right now, just within that purse, beat switch and such, sounds like that old you know who. Cinema. Stop that Pokemon shit. What you mean? Yo, Dave D always just knows how to come in with that aggression, man. Like, goddamn. Hold up. Hold up. Now, we all know that when it comes to Free Soul, he's going to use that auto tune. Like, we know that. But here's the thing, though. Here's my thing. If y'all been listening, if y'all are, if you've been listening to Free Soul's music as have, have, and such. You normally hear him like in them high tone ones, right? Sometimes, I don't know if he's normally went to the deep tone, like deep, deep tone ones. But it's normally like high tone with the auto tune and such. Y'all cannot tell me this don't sound like a different nigga. Like, you a fatality dead like Kenny. 
your fatality dead like Kenny. Ooh, nah. First, how you gonna switch from a Mortal Kombat bar to a South Park bar like that? Ugh. But I'm just saying, that, that, that's a different free soul. I'm not gonna lie. Look here, first of all, hold on, what you said, you say you move like a star? Oh, see that I'm a star. Now she into astrology. Now look, me personally, if anyhow a girl is into that whole astrology-ish, that's a red flag for me, uh-uh. Because then you're going to think that your, if your whole entire, your, it's basically like this. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with wanting to know what your signs are and all. But my gr my thing is, right? And this could go to a woman who wants to find guys too and such. Depending on what it is. But for me, right? If anyhow, your whole entire life and personality is just based upon how your zodiac sign is and such. Your astrology sign. Get the heck away from me. Get out of here. Because that means... Because that means I can't even want to rock with you then. Because that means you... Because, like, say for example, like, my my zodiac sign, I'm a Cancer, right? I born July 7th. So, I guess you can say, they might say, like, Cancer people are respectful, kindful, a little bit emotional. And, hey, sometimes it is true. But the thing is... You can say that for somebody who was born in September and such, or December, or January. Like, it really don't make a difference. So, me personally, I'm not taking that, I'm not taking that bar away from you, Free Soul. It's just me personally, whenever I see people on that whole astrology-ish, I just want to, like, scream at your ass. But, that's nearer here. But that's it, right? You see these shares like you walk in the shore, she says she sells by the she sore. Mm. Come on. Yo, this is definitely that old in a way you can say that's that old school that that's that old otaku underworld 20 like 2021 feeling and such so that's how it feels to me like bro because it but it has a way of mixing some new vibes because it has like that bass where it's like on like that what's it the drill and such but then with the guitar and such with sleepy ash hey that's why i always like when you mix some old stuff that you've done in your music career like when you're coming up in the career and put it in with your new stuff and such that you have going on. Because I always feel like that's what an artist should always want to do. Like, I'm not saying you should do what your old stuff needs to do. But look back at some of your old stuff and hey, incorporate into your new stuff. So that way it feels fresh. And everybody can say like, oh, this is so brand new and such. You never heard a sound like this before. And that's why I love when not just only Sleepy Ash but the rest of Otaku Underworld do it. Tally dead like Kenny Up in the bottle of bottle with Denny I'm gasping the bottle of bottles of Henny Pressure is on me, I'm thinking it's gravity Thoughts all around and I'm reaching capacity Bitches are going to add the dramatics Girl, I'm lying, different is magic Let's go, let's go 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 Let's go
motherfucking ass, nigga. Yo, I'm silent type. What the fuck is he talking about, man? Nash. Shout out to the freaking Otaku Underworld, man. Yo, my guy. Sleepy Ash. You need to start putting more niggas back on your songs. Start them features more often, my guy, because especially when it's your Otaku Underworld, brethren. Come on, man. Because cause honestly, I was about to say. Like I, like I said at the start of the video, my guy, ain't nothing wrong with you being the single on your own song, right? Ain't nothing wrong with you on your own songs. But you gotta remember, you run with a whole gang of spitters too. Start using them on your songs too, man. You know that. But hey, shout out to Dave D, shout out to Sleepy Ass, shout out to Free Soul. Y'all niggas killed y'all shit. And I don't wanna say this too. Y'all, I know y'all gonna say why, I'm, why I always wear the same shirts for, cause even though I be spreading these, even though it be different days, I be having the same shirts, cause I, cause in a way I've seen comments like that in the past. Look, for right now, I'm gonna keep this purple shirt on for a pre, for future reactions, cause especially with the whole Jujutsu Kaisen thing and such, Toji, Gojo, and all that. Hey, and I see that, and plus with the loop dropping music weekly well since it's a loop season and such i'm gonna be wearing this for real so be on the lookout for when i do that music mayhem with the loop and such so hey who knows it might be the next video after this but either way shout out to otaku on the world like i say man make sure to check out my other reactions right here follow me on all my socials up there and hey if you want to do a cash app donation request hit me up on my cash app as you see right up there but like I said, it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Shout out to the Vampire King himself again and the rest of Otaku on the world. Let go.